so hello and welcome back to the new video of the maven tutorial series so uh, now in this video we will seeing uh, some hot questions or uh, which are uh, frequently asked question in the maven interview questions if you are applying for any job uh, which job requires a Ma maven as a job requirement so so the interview in interview you can uh, ex expect these kind of questions been asked okay so we'll answer each question one by one uh, and try to solve then as well okay so let's go and take our first question uh, first question is what is maven okay so maven is a project management tool it is based on pom which is project object model uh, we have also covered uh, separate videos on pom uh, if you haven't checked that go ahead and check uh, where we have discussed all the file details regarding the pom file why pom file is important in maven okay so the next question is what aspects are managed by paven maven sorry uh, okay so the aspects that are ma managed by uh, maven is builds documentation reporting scms release and distribution these are the various aspects which are managed by maven okay so the what are the advantages of using maven why we use maven okay so the very first advantage is no need to add jar file in each project it creates the right direct stru directory structure and it builds and deploys the project and it also manages manages our dependencies and plugins so seamlessly that we need uh, that we need not need to worry about our dependencies as well okay so that is one of the advantages of maven as well okay so the what are the command to check the maven version okay so the command is mvn space minus version or else you can also type mvn let me write it out mvn minus v or or you can write mvn space minus version any one of this can you can write any one of this uh, to find the maven version you are currently using okay so next question is what does the build tool do okay so it generates the source code if the auto generated code is used okay and it generates the documentation from source code okay and another user it compiles our source code also uh, which is written in java okay so the package is compiled code into jar or zip file uh, this is one of the uh, uses of the build tool and it also installs the packaged code in the local repository server repository or the central repository okay so now next question is what is the difference between ant and maven so ant is a toolbox whereas the maven is a framework right and it is ant ant is mainly a build tool and maven is mainly a project management tool and and there is no life cycle and in maven we have life cycle and we have also seen what are the different phases of the life cycle also and and doesn't have formal conventions and maven has a convention to place source code and compile the code etc uh, and is procedural and maven is declarative why declarative because we declare our dependencies in the pom.xml file right and and is and scripts are not reusable whereas the maven plugins are reusable we can use maven plugins as and when required okay so uh, seventh question is define archetype okay so what is archetype in maven oh it is uh, in maven uh, the archetype it is a maven plugin which is designed for creation of the project structure so uh, as we have seen in a previous video when we are trying to create the web application we are selected the uh, archetype as web app so it is nothing but the structure that is predefined by the maven so if you if you want to create a web application you just go ahead and select the archetype as web application there are many more uh, archetype as uh, are there you can select uh, according to your uh, requirement okay so the next question is what is the purpose of mvn clean command okay so the command it so the mvn clean command removes the target directory before starting of a build process okay so imagine one scenario if you are created uh, if you are uh, build one project uh, the target project will get created and next time you do some modification and you are try again trying to uh, create that build uh, so uh, in order to delete the previous target folder you write, uh, write this command mvn clean command so that the previous build target folder will get removed 
from the directory and uh, after that you can again build the project and uh, again the target project target folder will be get created okay so next is uh, what are the build phases in maven okay so what are the different build phases in maven so first is validate compile test package integration test verify install and then deploy each one of these build phases are covered in depth in our in our previous previous video of the tutorial series you can go ahead and watch that video as well and next one is what is a repository in maven okay so what is a repository in maven this is our last question okay so the repository is a directory or a place where all the jars and pom.xml files are stored okay so the mainly the repositories are of three three types we have seen our uh, seen our in our videos as well one is local repository one is central repository and one is uh, remote repositories okay so these are the three types three types of repositories are there in maven as okay so these are the hot or uh, frequently asked question in the maven interviews okay so if you are preparing for the maven interviews you go ahead and uh, check these videos uh, check this uh, our uh, maven tutorial series and learn the maven thank you